Hey everybody, it's Red Panda Gamer here for another episode of Enter the Gungeon. Uh, in the last episode, we had B's and T's. We got a t-shirt gun and a freaking, uh, a, 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 a gun that shot the, a beehive that, that had bees in it. It was pretty cool. Uh, it wasn't cool enough to get us all the way through the game, not that I expected it to. Uh, but we made it pretty far, which is cool. I think we beat the third area boss. I don't know, it's been a couple days since I recorded. I usually just record these in bulk, and then I don't remember anything that happens. Um, but it's a new day. Yes, it is. And we're going to be playing as the pilot today. Uh, there's a quick start button at, like, the menu of the game, and it just kind of, like, gives you the last person you played as, and, like, puts you right into the dungeon, so... I didn't really get to do anything as far as, like, spending credits or anything like that goes. So we'll do that at the end of the episode. We just want to put some more guns into play. Uh, I don't need that now, but it'll be good to have in the future. Uh, I was worried that, like, since I haven't played this in, like, four days, that I wasn't going to remember how to play it, but I, I think I'm alright. It seems pretty simple. Uh, but I am hoping to... I saw, like, a, a video, someone else's video of this game, and they had found a gentleman that would basically build and, like, fix the elevator and let it go down. Like, the big bullet elevator that we go down into. But I haven't seen him, so I don't know why that's something that someone else has. Not even as far as I am. I don't know. Or maybe that's just something that happens randomly. Maybe it's someone I have to, like, unlock out of the jail. I'm really not sure. I'm guessing that's what it is. That's just someone I have to rescue, and I haven't yet, but... I don't know. I didn't want to, like, look too much into it, because I'd rather it be a surprise. But I did notice, like, I just kind of saw it without realizing I was being spoiled. There are a lot of dudes over here. I wish I had, like, an explosive weapon. I mean, I've gotten RPGs, and I've gotten grenade launchers, but I never seem to get them when it actually is helpful. Because in these earlier levels, I feel like they just, like, pile up a lot of, like, really basic enemies. So those red bullets, they don't do anything other than, like, they have a shotgun. It's all gone. Those are the ones that, like, they'll, like, blow up when you... Well, the blue guys will do, like, bullets, and they die, like, like, like that. And he didn't do it. So maybe they don't all do it? I don't know. I don't know why sometimes they do it, sometimes they don't. Alright. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you're the spaghetti man, sometimes you're the meatball. Which would you prefer to be, the spaghetti or the meatball? Feel free to comment down below. The statue fills you with a sense of foreboding. Stay. Oh, okay. So we gotta fight these things now. That's fine. Ooh. Yeah. Those explosions have like so much impact. So this is just like a like a not a boss rush, but just like a rush. Oh no. Get out of here. Oh god. That's fine. As long as we don't take any other, any other damage, we're fine. That's one Jawa down. The other one. Oh, that's... Well, I took another hit when I said I would. That's what we call lying. I'm a, a filthy liar. I need to take another shower. My body is riddled with lies. What the heck? Oh, man. Okay, that was not the, a good way to dodge that. I did not foresee this. Oh, man. I think when you hit them into the water, you don't get money from them, which sucks. And also, something else I haven't been doing, like, in the videos is, like, every single, like, enemy and weapon has, like, a pretty, like, well-written description. Like, almost like a Dark Souls description for a weapon or an item. Um, and I haven't been really reading them during episodes, because I just, like... When I live... When I last longer in these... Oh, cool. And we got a mug? A jet... We got a jetpack? Do I just hover over? Nope, that's not. That was not what that was. How do I use it? How do I use the jet? Wait, okay. How do I use different active items? How do you switch between active items? I don't. I don't know. Oh, with that. How do I use it? I think it's this button. Oh my god! I have a jetpack. Oh, that's cool. How long does it last? I don't know. Does it blow up? I have so many questions that I feel like I'm not going to get the answers till it's already too late. I don't want to waste it. Can I just always use it? There's no, like, meter or anything. It's a ghost! Well, that's cool. 
Oh, I can't roll when I'm using it, though. So that's definitely a downside, I guess. But I'm flying, so who cares? I'm invincible! Oh, God, I, I'm not invincible. I flew right into an exploding barrel. Not, not invincible. Can confirm. Still can very much die. Uh, but, oh, I was reading, like, descriptions of enemies, and I, I've been confused the whole time. Like, why is that sword guy in this gun game? Like, he doesn't belong here. Uh, but his sword is out, is made out of bullets, I guess, which is kind of cool. Uh, isn't there a heart somewhere? It's gone now, or did I collect it already? Do those items disappear after a while? Because if that's the case, that really sucks. Yeah, I move much faster with this jetpack, like... Well, I mean, yeah, I definitely move faster. Um, my girlfriend's here. She just threw up. I'm fine. Now she's fine. Oh, I found an ammo, an ammo Oh, wait, did you want these? No, I was, I was saying oh. for you. She just threw up, so I was telling her to have some crackers and Diet Coke. I'm fine. It's fine. It's probably fine. But if I have to leave suddenly, it's it's because she passed out. Like I open I opened I opened the bathroom door and it just reeked of bleach. I'm like, what well, what have you done? But it was fine. Everything is cool, man. Can I fly over this cool. All right. Do you guys have any fun puke stories? Be sure to comment down below your your fun puke stories. I don't really have any. Do I? Oh, duh. We played Edward Forty Hands. Uh, for the, the uninitiated, Edward Forty Hands is what it sounds like. You duct tape two forties to each of your hands. Well, one forty to each hand. And you can't take them off till you drink the whole thing. And I, I drank both of them pretty quick. And then, and then, and then, and then I threw up a lot. And we were gonna make a video of it, and it just never, it never, it never happened. Well, we did make the video, but I never edited it. So I got this gun that's that's just a lowercase r. Oh my god. Alicia. I have a gun that shoots out the word bullet. What? Oh, kind of, yeah. But it just, like, spells it out? Look. And it says bullet. Bullet. Uh, when I push it, it, it does that. Yeah, it's like a semi-automatic? I don't know, I don't know shit about guns. Uh, also, I have a lock. I have no idea what you're saying. Oh. I also have this trusty lock pick, and it usually doesn't work. I, don't, I didn't use it right. I fucked up. I shouldn't have used it. Uh, when it doesn't work, you, you, you break the lock, so... That's unfortunate. I thought I should have used it. But I, I didn't expect to find a key or anything, so... I really wanted to buy this gauntlet. I don't know if it's a weapon or if it's, like, armor, but... Oh, well. One day... Have I done everything? I keep pushing the wrong thing. Uh, I've been everywhere. Let's go fight the boss. I think it's gonna be King Bullet, but... I don't know. Nope. Who is this? Is this someone new? Oh, it's the Bullet Brothers. They're kinda cool. I ain't even met. Trigger Twins, not Bullet Brothers. Well, Trigger Twins, prepare to be shot with my gun that says Bullet. So, last time I did this, I tried to just, like, take her health out. Like, mostly at the same time. I probably get off this jetpack. It's not really doing any favors here. I mean, I guess being able to move quicker is good for evasion. Oh god, okay. Wait, did I automatically... Oh, I think that's the thing I have. That's where I automatically... ...do the thing. I, mean, I guess this bullet gun is pretty cool, but it doesn't seem that much stronger. I guess it's alright. I did this one. I don't know what the Trigger Twins' name, Trigger Trigger Twins' names are. I gotta have names individually, and I, I don't know what they would be. We, we could call them. I'm trying to think of good, good punny gun names. I'm just having a hard time with it. 
This is obviously a cool one because he's got glasses. Alright, that one's dead and. Oh, wait. Oh, they get some of their health back. That was just a waste. Well, I'm assuming that much when I came back no matter what. I missed that the first time. He doesn't seem like he does that much more, though. Like, he, he he's a little faster and. Oh, that is back. He's a little bit faster and he shoots a little bit faster, but it doesn't seem like he does much beyond that. Oh, and of course, now I get a key. I could have opened that one. And I got an anvil? An anvil? An fuck's it. Anvil? Do I throw anvils at people? That's the only thing I could think, possibly think of. I don't know. So, we got through the first floor pretty easily. All we have is our bullet gun. Well, I guess we have our normal sidearm, but it's not all that great. But at least it's fun. You know? Sometimes you just gotta do what's fun. And I still wanna know what this thing does. It only has 66 ammo. So I'm guessing it does something good. Oh wait. Bullet. 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 Alright. Bullet. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna use this anymore. Because it doesn't seem like it's actually that good. I do want to see what this does, though. What? What did that do? Oh, it does shoot an amp. Oh, it also makes it dizzy. That doesn't seem that great. Okay. I need to... Oh, Battleborn open beta installed. Great. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I'm going to keep using this jetpack. Right now, we have a... We have a pretty, like... We have a pretty weak run going here. Like, we have a lot of cool sounding stuff, but none of it's actually all that good. Uh, I'm gonna switch back to my trusty lockpick. I'm just gonna shoot you from here, dude. We're just gonna get closer and closer. Oh, that's dumb. I feel like this is gonna be a disappointing run overall. Oh no, this is bad. Oh god, he's gonna come in here and fill the whole room. That wow, I died. Fuck. Well, this all right. I'm gonna just keep going because this is a sad episode. I'm just gonna quick restart with the pilot. That was bad. That was very bad. I'm I'm mostly disappointed with myself. I feel like I let everyone down, but mostly I let myself down. Alright, maybe a little better luck this time. You know, just gotta get the, gotta shake the cobwebs off. Unless, like, cobwebs is an accessory or something, then you're probably Elvira, or Sven Gulli, or some other 90s reference that I'm probably not should be making. I feel like any of the weapons we got there. I, like, that anvil gun doesn't really seem a whole lot of it. The anvil gun didn't seem like it was doing much damage. I mean, the fact that it makes them dizzy is good. Oh, it probably also goes through enemies, so if have a whole group of them like this, it'd be helpful. It took two hits, though. That's, that's not a good start. This game is not. It's very sparing at all. We have a grenade friends. Oh no. Oh, I could roll through a grenade? That's... Right. Doesn't matter. I already kind of want to restart this one. But I guess as long as we're smart, which we tend to not be... See, sometimes they explode. I don't really know why sometimes they do and sometimes they don't. Oh, we got a lot of money in that one. It's a tough one. No, 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 I hate these bullets. Sometimes they don't do the thing. Like they, like they'll go into the wall and then they'll like come out somewhere else. That's what this ghost, this, this Tommy Gun ghost has. We're gonna move first. Can I see that time I did it? Oh look, I got my little box here. Has made a little fort. I 
Oh, okay. Just goofing around, being, being dumb. And see where it gets. Fuck you! Eat those books! There's a lot of these things. I cannot believe how much damage I'm taking. It's very sad. What is that? Is it like increase old cylinder? Reload faster. I guess that's. Oh, well, that's way faster. Damn. That's good. That's helpful. I mean, I don't know how long we're gonna have it, but maybe it'll help us stay alive longer by being able to just shoot more. I wonder if there's any guns where it's like one shot with a lot of ammo and a lot of damage. It's like that fast reload would be super crucial. Alright, so nothing else over here. Definitely one of the most abusive passive items we've gotten so far in this game. As far as I can remember. They didn't put anything else in this room to make it more difficult. Oh, get him! Oh, get him! God. I just want a good new gun. Oh my god. It's just sad. This whole run is just sad. This episode is disappointing. I probably shouldn't even post it, but I'm gonna. I just, ah oh man, I don't want to die to the boss of all things either. I'll probably die before it, though. Just get hit by some stray bullet. Or get blown up. <laughs> that seems very likely. Alright, shop. I'm totally buying a gun over hell. Oh, what is that? Lichy trigger finger, of course. Heavy bullets, ammo, key. None of that is helpful. Yeah, I guess I'll buy a key. Even though I, there's really no reason to buy anything. I should, I could just save, but I honestly don't think I'm gonna make it that far. I just want another gun. Does that one have an eye patch? Look at this. They're definitely taking it a little bit easy on me now. Queen bullet? Oh, nice. Not. Nice. Oh. Alright, I didn't see what this was. Oh, it's oh I've gotten this before. It's the flaming pistol. So maybe we can make something happen, depending on who the boss is. Oh, okay, I'll probably die. Nope, yep. Fucking alright, well, this was a this was a bad this is a bad one, and that's my bad, but keep check back tomorrow when I hopefully don't fail you, and I'm sorry. Uh we, oh we can run to the store real quick to do some permanent unlocks. This is just bad. I'm just I'm sorry. Uh I'm, I guess it doesn't matter. I'll just take you so we can hang out the dog real quick to feel better about something. Uh, let's just go ahead and go here. Make some purchases. I think we can just buy both of these things, right? Yeah. All right, so we bought everything. What happens now? When does it? When does it read? I do care for Mistress Cadence, but I suspect I am programmed to. Yeah, that sounds about right. Want to buy something? Talk to Alex. I don't deal with customers. All right, so we bought everything. Um, I don't know. I don't know how often that refreshes or anything like that. Maybe as we make it to new floors. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Sorry if this one was disappointing. Uh, be sure to check the next one, which will probably be a little tiny bit better. Bye! Ugh.